Hi, I'm Patrick with Homemade Grow, and today I want to talk to you about unpackaging your space bucket and setting it up. You get a box like this, open it up, the bucket pops right out. First, take out the two fan app or spacers. One, two. Take out the top bucket. Now within this five gallon bucket inside, you have to pull out the water reservoir. Again, the water reservoir is inside the five gallon bucket. You need to pull it out. Once you pulled it out, you should have a five gallon bucket with holes drilled on the bottom. Those holes are for the wicking rope. So now let's talk about everything else that's in there. We have the wicking rope, a piece of aluminum tape, grow bag, fan, power cord for the fan, timer, Power strip, bucket stand, fan adapter, screws for the fan adapter, and a filter. This is how the bucket stand is supposed to look. We want to talk about how you can assemble it if it doesn't come assembled like this. So you get two long pieces, two short pieces, and three elbows. You take the long pieces, stick the elbows in, so that it forms an L. Rotate, far elbow up, rotate, up, and stick in the small pieces. This is your assembled bucket stand. Now we want to talk about attaching the fan to the fan adapter. Take your bag of screws, take out the four long screws. Take the fan and look at the arrow on the side of the fan. Right here. You want this arrow pointing outward so that the fan is blowing air out instead of sucking air in. Once you make sure that it's blowing out, place that over the fan adapter. Put the four screws on the corners. and screw in the screws. Now we're gonna attach the fan adapter with the fan to the bucket. Take your fan adapter, take your filter, put the filter behind the fan adapter. Take two screws that are remaining in the bag. There are two nuts. Place the screw through the top and bottom mounting holes. Stick it through the holes in the bucket.
then get your screw and screw it in from the inside. And now here's the fan with the fan adapter installed on the top bucket. Now we're going to tape the power cord onto the top bucket. Get your duct tape, tear, tear a piece off, roll it, tape it on the back, and tape it on. If you want it more secure, get another piece and mount the piece on like so. One on the bottom. One on the top. Okay. We're going to install the wicking rope into the five gallon bucket. You want to take the wicking rope and tie a knot on the ends. So take your rope, take the knotted end, the knotted end goes inside the bucket, and you just pull the string through from the bottom. So stick the string in and pull through. Stick the string in to a hole and pull through. Take the string in, bucket, pull through from the underside. Okay. And now the string is installed. Now they have all your pieces set up. Let's uh, set up the bucket. Take your bucket stand, put in the water reservoir. Take your five gallon bucket, place it on top. So you see the string? Go straight in. This is where you'll water out the water. You can have one extension, two extensions, and the top bucket. So once you have all this down, take your grow light. Place it on top, snugly. It's held in place. Take the power cord for the grow light. Plug it in. And plug into the power strip. Take the power adapter for the fan light that comes with the space bucket. And plug it into the fan. Now plug it in. And when you're ready, you can take the timer. And instead of plugging in here, Push it in and plug in the, the light. Shortly talk about how you can use the self-watering feature to water your plant. So your grow bag is made of fabric. When your plant gets big enough, you can transplant it in here. And once it's ready, place it into the five gallon bucket. Make sure that the bottom of the grow bag touches the wicking rope. Now, you can water in here, and the water will wick up into the grow bag and water your plant. I hope you like learning how to assemble your space bucket. If you like this video, please click on the like button or subscribe to our channel.